Corrandoke was one of um, six Aboriginal stations in Victoria where um, surviving people of um, Victoria, Indigenous people, were contained after the onset of colonisation. And although it was a place of containment and incarceration, it became a thriving community thanks to the leadership of Barak, Simon Wongo and John Green. And um, it was only when um, colonisation had surrounded the station that um, vested interests pressured the, the Board for the Protection of Aborigines to disband the station. And this triggered uh, a rebellion and a, and a protest campaign on behalf of the community of Corrandoke to try and save their land and have control of their land. And so that the key uh, element of the story of Corrandoke is really the struggle for land and self-determination and dignity. When did you go up the island? About three weeks ago. Did you refuse to do it? Yes. Were, were you paid wages for doing it? No. Why did you refuse? Because I did not want to do it. We often think of uh, Aboriginal and black movement in Australia starting in the 60s or 70s when, when the advancement leagues came about. But this reminds us that Aboriginal people have been fighting for self-determination for 130 years. 